Hello, my name is Peter Johnson, working as a tech sales, pre-sales uh, solutions architect with the IBM Cognos Business Analytics brand. I'm here today to talk a little bit about self-service business intelligence and rapid deployment uh, business intelligence. Many of organizations, customers we see today uh, looking for a little bit faster solutions that uh, with better visualizations and easier to deploy to a vast number of users. We'll start with the IBM Cognos uh, solution here that I bring up and as you can see I can uh, pretty fast drag and drop uh, business content information right in the canvas on the on the screen here with uh, Excel, uh, CSV, JPEG or any other type of data from uh, the normalized uh, databases. What I'm going to work with is uh, to start with a fairly simple uh, Excel spreadsheet here uh, with about a thousand rows with some uh, revenue cost uh, information associated with it. So I'll take that uh, spreadsheet, drag and drop it over to the canvas. Pretty quickly I get this information brought up in my uh, dashboard pane. Bring over months. And change the columns here to get rid of the 3d don't need a count but i might want to add my own little calculation here when i see revenue cost and i want to see a margin there for example the coloring say jazz for example looks pretty good bring that up I can take that information and uh, use it a little bit more scarce here on my my real estate on my, on my screen and I might now be able to uh, filter on this information as a normal uh, pivot table so what I've brought in is uh, part of my Excel spreadsheet in a dynamic all up cube fashion it has converted in my uh, uh 64 bit in memory uh, application style i can take product type information sales information and some of these uh, measures that i created and i can arrange these here in a nice and formatted fashion very intuitive very self-service allowing my users to uh filter on the information that they might want to see here so I'm allowing a more uh, associative analysis where I can filter on what I want to filter on and release any filters as I please and uh, as you can see it works uh, works pretty quick there we go Another thing that I want to show you is uh, make a copy of this widget, paste it below here. And when I have that done, I might get rid of this to only include a chart. So now I see my sales, my costs, my margins in terms of months. What I want to do now is uh, allow I use to look at this in a uh, quarter fashion. I can see that if I focus on my margins, that my margins seem to slip from October, November, December, and January. I have a negative margins on all my Q4 uh, initiatives. And that's something that I want to rectify going into the coming uh, months and quarters. And this is done by looking at the quarters, uh, Q4, I see that my, my revenue is low, my, my costs are a little bit higher. I can say 3,917,000 of revenue in that quarter. I would love that to be at least uh, five. I take 5,000K, 5 million, and I can do a write back right into my screen here, producing uh, another number. I say, I undo that one and I say, instead of that, let's increase by 55% and I bring up to 6,000 I spread that uh, increase uh, over the three months of the fourth quarter I might want to lower my uh, 
my costs with uh, a decrease of 25 percent and i can see that i've actually uh, uh moved my uh my, my targets a little bit uh, looking a little bit better for for the coming uh, quarters going in so is this my planning and budgeting solution absolutely not this is a, a forecasting tool within my business analytics uh, uh, self-service dashboard pane that I can allow or not allow users to uh, work with in this in this manner but it's it's the it's there to use I have uh, different types of uh, information panes that I can uh, change my coloring and uh, make this a little bit nicer or not the palette might can be like that and um, from this on I've created my own uh, dashboard and being able to uh, save uh, produce publish to uh, other users in my in my community I want to bring that over to the web-based uh, portion and say what if users on the web also want to create dashboard environments more of a self-service uh, fashion i can take pre fabricated components of my bi tool a uh, simple pie chart it's loading up can rearrange that a little bit a simple uh, simple bar chart and a combination chart a little bit bigger and I want to make sure that this one takes about this much space and we can see that we're looking at sales in terms of revenue for our different products sales in terms of different order methods for our products and in terms of quantity and sales for the different countries in our different regions for the the two years that I have in my data deck take a selection value filter allowing my users in a self-service fashion being able to filter in on territory name for example so my users can actually select which region they want to see the data filtered for in terms of order method and product type not only that i want to see from the two years that i have data let me bring in a slider filter works very well with time information for example months years quarters this case I'm using a quarter and I'm allowing my users to filter on the information that they want to see from uh, month to month quarter to quarter so here I actually produced a self-service rapid deployment BI tool for uh, on the web not all users should actually uh, sit here and create uh, dashboards on the fly or self-service dashboarding but actually consume some of the prefabricated pre-built uh, dashboards solutions that we have have a selection of that where users can use for example in this case a sales and marketing dashboard looking at our three different product groups alpha charger and nova product group and i rapidly can filter on the key metrics inquiry revenue market revenue order revenue etc for the three different product groups slide over to see different market analysis for different regions where i have or do not have information should not also forget in this uh, context uh, when we're talking about the dashboard self-service rapid deployment that uh, production reporting formatted report and statement style reporting is of key interest where uh, for example in a finance uh, environment that our revenue in profit and loss uh, statement style report uh, income statement is of key information uh, key target for North America Europe Asia when I say I want to filter on uh, this type of information for a more uh, statement style or format and reporting type of environment so with those words I say thank you very much my name is Peter Johnson as a tech sale pre-sales uh, solution architect for the business analytics brand with IBM Cognos in Sweden thank you very much